The vast majority of the executions were carried out at Kilmainham Jail during a 10-day period in May 1916. When it came to forming up the firing squads that marched along this track from the barracks towards Kilmainham Jail, the British soldiers were willing enough. They'd seen their comrades mown down by snipers just a few days before. Amongst the officers and NCOs, feelings were more complex. Second Lieutenant William Wiley, a barrister, was an unwilling prosecutor who believed that the courts martial should be held in public and that the accused should be assigned a defence lawyer. Out of a sense of justice, he conducted effectively both the prosecution and the defence. 